Dr. Green Stanley, welcome to our incredible Ghana Repatriation Investment Conference. I actually met David in 2006, so that's our 12 years, but our 12 strong years. And, you know, we, you know, we are, there's our uh, two conscious brothers that, uh, that were connected by divine faith of our ancestors. Because I've never stopped working with David. You know, we have our little back and forth with certain things because we're trying to make sure that we work very, very, you know, diligent for our people. So we always have to just connect with our minds and say, this is the work I'm doing, this better and better. So over the last uh, 12 years, uh, we have connected a lot of people to where they can uh, repatriate, live and do business in Ghana. And the goal is just really for us to, you know, work together, make it happen. So Africans on the continent and Africans in the diaspora, and definitely Africans are repatriated to the continent. We definitely have to link, strive, and work harder to make sure things work for ourselves. So, uh, America can be nice, but the reality at the end of the day, it's an individual game, and you know, it's not something that's going to progress us. It's just, you know, what we know it as, you know, the ultimate trap. So we put together this conference, and we encourage more and more of our people to connect and network. So at the end of the session, I'm at, besides never one to not run out the building and run back home, uh, one of, keep things open for networking. You can stay here a little longer. And then downstairs, we plan, plan to do a whole lot of networking. I have three people that are staying back, and they're looking uh, to connect with some incredible families that maybe can host them for a few days. That way they can get the other aspect of what we put together. Now, the tour is incredible, take you around the country and give you a feel of the country. But staying with one of our brothers and sisters that were patriated for our Ghanaian family is another part of it. So we always recommend if you can get here earlier, or if you can stay longer, use that route to build your energy. That way you have clear experience on how things are really on the ground. Uh, so this journey, tour that we do in business conference is definitely one of, it's an introduction and we shoot these videos to share with our family around the world. So everything that we shoot today will be uploaded online and the, the goal is just to keep energy strong and keep things going. That's one of those things where um, we're not expecting everyone just to give up their life in America and just come to Ghana and move. So we know people are not quick to just do it like that and we want people to make organized plans. And the better we can organize and plan together, the better so I really want to push that we can work together to build true communities because I have a lot of people um, in America that call me and they want to repatriate and they explain to me that it's so secure the money don't go that long and certain things don't go that long. So I've been trying to find true communities. We originally started with Piankra and you know, we did our best to work on that project. But since then, after eight years, we have moved forward and I'm looking to connect with more people who have true land connections that can assist us at the highest level. Um, because it's, you know, my frustration is, I have so much people calling me and telling me that they hear about land issues in Ghana, and they say, this happened to this person, this happened to that person. So the only way we can truly prevent that is that we have a strong form and make sure the people that are connected to us are definitely dedicated to what we're looking to build. And it's not about just getting quick money from us and everything. Uh, so we have a good energy of people that are interested in Ghana, and I don't want to see the energy in Ghana die because another country will pop up tomorrow and people just forget about Ghana. It's, you know, it can't happen. So while Ghana has this momentum, let's try to do something with the momentum, build these communities, build factories, build these connections, and keep the network going. So I appreciate my brother David and all of our brothers and sisters here that will be presented today. And they're your true connection. If you want to return and come back, maybe spend a few months or so, connect with the people that you're networking today. And their, their, you know, their, their goal is to connect with you also because more and more of us that are uh, here want to see more of us for the diaspora return home. Uh, so we all have our important part to play in the role of this future of this Black Power Nation Building Revolution. You see I'm always decked out my RB, double G, red, black, green, and gold. So family, pass the mic back to David. Appreciate the family. Appreciate you. Let's give them a round of applause. We're very well bringing 